This is um, Kathy Hart, and today we've got um, Christine, who's a certified registered nurse anesthetist at um, Delta Hospital and one of our graduates. And so, Christine, please introduce yourself and include a little bit about your nursing career and education. So I'm Christine Hamilton. Um, I graduated from the LPN program in 1994. Then I went on to the Optel program um, for my ADN the next year and graduated in 95. And then um, did my online BSN through Regents College, uh, which is now Excelsior College in, of New York. And then I went to anesthesia school in um, 1999 um, in Yankton, South Dakota at Mount Marty College. Okay. And then, then I've just been working. <laughs> That's cool. So tell us a little bit about the Optel program when you were here. I'm just curious because we don't, we have a few people that have been through that, but I'm not sure mm -hmm. people will know what that means. So. Okay. Um, so we basically, it was through Trinidad State Junior College was the degree, but um, we just met in class and looked and um, would, our teacher would teach. And then some of the teachers from Trinidad or other, I think there was Elmosa too. They would all teach and we would just watch it on the TV um, and then um, do our testing and stuff at Delta at the vocational center there. Okay. Awesome. Thank you. Um, and tell us a little bit about why you chose to attend the LPN program here. What brought you here? Um, I, I really was indecisive of what I was going to do with myself. I had started in a um, business um, computer science program at Mesa and just kind of got bored. So I decided to apply for the nursing program and see if I could get in. And I did. I was okay. one of the um, alternates, actually. My best friend and I both were alternates, so we both got in. Okay, that's great. Um, tell us a little bit about your time here as a student and basically what you remember um, about that year, such as when you attended, how many, if you can remember, a lot of people can't remember how many students were in their class, but I think any memorable experiences when you think about your year here, what do you think about? Um, I, I want to say there was probably about 30 students and uh, a lot of them, a few of them of us were young, um, but most of them were um, already had kids and uh, were kind of doing it a, as a secondary project for them, but um, which I thought was crazy to go to school and have kids at the same time. <laughs> but um, but yeah, I had, we had a good class, you know, we generally got along and, um, and I had, I was with Jeannie Robb as my preceptor for for the uh, and the um, classes or the stuff at the hospital. Sorry. Um, so so we did that with her and um, but all of the all the teachers. Um, Judy uh, was also one of the teachers and then Sherry, of course. Um, so all of them were very helpful and and inspiring us to complete the course and and move on to more better things. That's awesome. That's great. We, we missed them when they left. I'll tell you that. So yes. <laughs> <laughs> um, what do you feel you gained from your time here? What what did you bring forward to, with you to your career that you think is still there even maybe today? Um, I felt like it was the strongest nursing program that I did out of all three of them. Um, I, it was very intense and um, but I liked the hands on part of it and because I'm very tact tactical and um, like to be task oriented a little bit, which is not all nursing, but um, I really enjoyed that part of it. And so the, the base that I got with the LPN program basically helped me with the RN, ADN and RN, BSN programs, because um, I already knew it. So it really wasn't, didn't seem like the other programs added that much to what I already, had already learned. Excellent. Um, so tell us a little bit, uh, when you reflect back and, and do that reflecting, is there any positive memory that you have, either an experience or I've had people say something funny that happened to them, but anything that you can think about that sticks out in your mind is something positive from here? Um, well, I met my husband that I'm now with for 26 years. Uh, when I was in clinicals at the hospital, he had um, started, he was in nuclear medicine and x-ray and um, he had come to get one of my patients to take him for a nuclear scan and the patient was happened to be in the shower and I said we're we're busy right now you can't you can have to come back I, he's in the shower so 
Um, my husband actually joked with me at their, he wasn't my husband then, but he joked with me and said, boy, we have good service around here. <laughs> nice. Nice. So. That's cool. <laughs> so well, it was fun. Yeah. Open new doors in all sorts of directions for you, it sounds like. Yes. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Is there anything else you'd like to add today? Anything you'd like the people out there that, that watch this video to know? Um, I just feel like the nurses that do go through an LVN program um, are, I think they're more prepared than a lot of the BSN program nurses. Um, just because I, I don't know if it's more management based because it's a BSN or what, but uh, the, we have better nurses that come out of the LPN program. Okay, absolutely. Absolutely. The letters are, are definitely a benefit to our profession, I think. Yes. Absolutely. All right. Well, thank you for your time. Um, I'm going to stop the recording.